Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. For anybody that's new here, my name is Rachel and I'm the style blogger behind therachelreview.com. And in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a quick review of this Burberry Diamond Quilted Jacket right here. So this is a very, very popular jacket that Burberry makes. They have a new variation of this jacket every year. It is a super lightweight, easy to wear, awesome spring or fall jacket and I'm going to review everything that you might want to know about the jacket, how I've worn it, when I bought it, um, and if you have any questions that I haven't covered in this review just leave me a comment in the section down below and I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. So let's just jump right into this review. I got this jacket back in I want to say February of 2017 so this is about a year old and it's worn up, I mean, it's it's really held up pretty well. So the inside, it's got the Burberry check, as you can see. It also has the Burberry check here on the flap. So you can pop your collar and be like, ooh, Burberry. <laughs> and a lot of people love to wear the sleeves with them just rolled about, about a half an inch like that, or maybe about an inch actually, just so you can showcase the check and showcase that it is a Burberry jacket. So throughout the pattern of the jacket, it's a very well structured jacket, very well fitted. I'm not sure if you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about here, but there is some lines really, really well for giving you some shape. It's got these little tails in the back here. And it's kind of hard to see this because it is a black jacket, but I will be inserting some pictures and some videos of me wearing it so you will get, so you will get the full effect of what it looks like on. So it's just got this really cute detail. and. First and the most basic thing about this jacket is that it is a grab and go lightweight jacket. My favorite thing about this coat is wearing it to the airport. I never travel without it. Usually I'm traveling to a warmer climate, but I'm leaving Boston and it's usually cold up here. So I take this jacket with me to the airport. It's lightweight. It fits right beside me in my seat. It's easy to fold up if I want to throw it in my luggage and it's just very lightweight. That's what I love about it. So I think a spring jacket or a fall jacket should be lightweight. It should be form fitting and very structured, which this jacket absolutely is and it should come in a variety of colors. So this jacket I got in black because I wanted something basic, but Burberry makes a variation of this jacket every year and they make it in all different colors. So sometimes the variations will include things like a little pocket detail or a differentiation in the check or the diamond quilted print. But other than that, the variations are very slim and if you're looking to buy this jacket, I would actually recommend buying it pre-loved. So if you are going to buy it and you want to cut the price in half, I would say to buy it on a website such as therealrail.com, which is a website where I buy all of my pre-owned or pre-loved goods from. And I have a review on that website as well that you can check out that I will link down below. But I really like wearing this around because it just keeps me warm. The material, I will say, is polyester, so it is 100% polyester. I think it actually has a little bit of cotton on the inside, like where the quilted part is. I'm not 100% sure on that, but it's mostly polyester, which I'm not crazy about. And I'll get to that in a lot of the videos on my channel about why. I tend to avoid synthetic materials. I just don't think they give off a very classy vibe, but this jacket hides it well. So if you are going to invest in it, like I said, it keeps you warm, it's lightweight, buy it pre-loved, and the other thing too is that it wears very, very snugly. So this is an extra small, right? And it fits me very well, it fits me very tight and you can see in the pictures here, but I think I would have preferred to go up to a small because this just gets to my sleeves, like the sleeve just fits to my wrist. So when I wear it with the sleeves kind of pulled over, which I really like this tucked over look on the sleeves, um, it kind of looks a little bit short on my arm. So my one regret is that I got it in the extra small. But when I bought it, I really wasn't thinking of all the things that I'm thinking of now that I've worn it for a little bit. So take my advice if you do buy it and you're wondering, should I go a size down or a size up? Go with the size up because it does fit very snugly on. So great for spring, great for fall because of that. So let me put this jacket on just here for you guys to kind of see how it looks with the fold and the 
so here is the jacket on very lightweight i'd even wear it in the house honestly it's just that comfortable so this is definitely a great jacket to bring with you to work to travel um, to the airport i know i've already said that but i just i love it as an airport necessity is this jacket i love being able to pop the collar in the back not that i ever really wear it like this but that's just kind of like sleek like hey <laughs> And I love it in the black color. They also have other colors of this jacket too. So they have it in pink, they have it in red, they have it in a taupe color, which looks really, really great on. I would definitely say to get it in black or taupe. Neutrals are always the best way to go because they're very versatile. So you never want to invest in a piece of clothing that can't be worn multiple times because then you're kind of only wearing it once or on a special occasion and it doesn't really give you the maximum use for your piece. This piece is one of those pieces where I can wear it with everything. I can wear it with casual things. I can wear it with fancier things. I can wear it in the spring. I can wear it in like cool summer nights. I could wear it in the fall. Even winter here in New England, I've been able to wear this with a thicker sweater underneath. And even though it's a little bit tight, it still manages to keep me really warm. I wear it to the office every day when I go to work and I'm just really, really happy with this purchase. So if you are interested in buying a Burberry quilted jacket, or I think it's actually officially called the Burberry diamond quilted jacket, check it out on the Burberry website. I will link all of the pre-loved versions of this jacket that I can find down below. So you guys can check it out there too. And if you have one of these jackets, let me know what you think in the comments section below, because I'm always interested in hearing what you guys have to say and what you think about different fashion choices. This seems to be a staple in the luxury market and Burberry offers it every single year. So it seems to do well across the board, but I wanna know what you guys think. So that is it for today's review. If you guys have any questions, leave them down below. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe for more luxury and fashion videos. And I will catch you guys next time here on The Rachel Review. Bye.